They're worried that the prefect is going to shut down the border. Right? Yeah. Well, um, I heard that. I heard some messages on um, social media, mm -hmm. and I, we questioned the the, um, the prefecture, and the answer was just no. There's no um, decision taking to um, close the border or control the border uh, again. Um, I can only respond on what has been telling, what, what have been t um, told to me. But um, I don't think that we would get to that point because what happened a couple um, weeks, a couple months ago, uh, with uh, asking to reopen um, the border, uh, I don't think that we're going to face that situation again due to what happened at that time. So um, to answer clearly, um, that's probably rumors. Uh, but a question was asked again to the services of the prefecture, and uh, there was no way that uh, that decision would as, was in a pipeline. The situation that we're going to face here today, it's a tremendous unemployment on this island. We are ready to 25 percent in the youth. So that means that that's big figures. That means that we are far over the national average, which is, uh, I think, uh, under 8 or uh, 9 percent. We are to 25 percent. And that's enormous for a small island like St. Martin. And that shows that we are dependent on one economy. And that's why the focus needs to be put in place on that part of the economy that makes us, I would say, um, booming our, 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 our function in here. That shows us also overall that we need to di um, diversify our economy so that in the future we are not stick only on one type of economy. Mm -hmm. We need to have the, a, vari a variety of new economy. That was the plan also when I came in in government. Um, that was something that we, we needed to focus on, agriculture, uh, fisheries, new technology, internet, whatever. Those, those new type of, um, of economy needs to be augmented, needs to be amplified, and that's what we're working on. We cannot do everything at the same time. I have a mandate of five years. In five years, if you're asking me to fix everything that was going wrong from even before IOMA, it's going to be quite complicated, even without IOMA. So imagine with IOMA, with the, with the riots, with the social issues, with um, COVID-19, 19. It is it is a lot on 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 uh, on, on, on the board, um, but we are doing things oh. step by step. But you need to leave those clients come to Saint Martin because it's um, it, it's going to determine the, the future of um, of Saint Martin. If we reach to, um, and which is going to be the case actually, um, to December, uh, without any reservation mm -hmm. in our hotel room, it's going to be it's going to become a problem. And you know, when we have a problem on one side of the island. If one side catches the cold, the other, the other side gets sick, and vice versa. So these are the things that we need to take in consideration. And you cannot have St. Bart that can receive um, that type of clientele. You cannot have St. Martin that can receive that type of clientele. Anguilla, since the 1st of November, and St. Martin, French St. Martin is in the middle um, with being able to, and being able to receive people from St. Bart that frequent those Americans, people from the Dutch side that frequent those Americans, that it makes absolutely no sense. You know, I had the Minister for uh, Tourism and Economic Affairs in the program mm -hmm. two weeks ago, and she was concerned that uh, the French side of the island was restricting uh, certain activity from the Dutch side, like tour operators, etc. And she was very worried that the prefect might go back to another lockdown. Mm -hmm. Because, as you said, you know, we, we, we need each other. Mm -hmm. Have you had any uh, contact with her? Well, um, I got that information, uh, actually, uh, from the same um, minister, but also from um, other um, part of the population. Mm -hmm. Hearing, and there was on social media, yeah. a voice note that was circulating. I immediately asked um, the services of the prefecture uh, what was the situation as yeah. far as that's concerned. And I got a negative answer immediately stating that there was no way in the pipeline that there would be a control of the border, a shutdown of the border, um, no way. Probably a lockdown uh, of the French side if figures go too high, that I know we are always under um, the, um, I would say, the shutdown or, or the lockdown. But not the control she of the border. She also mentioned that the charter boats, etc., are not allowed in, in the. Well, part. that's a problem that, that is uh, pending for a little while since mm -hmm. the first lockdown, in which uh, we brought to uh, the prefect stating that, I mean, it was always a, a situation where the Dutch boats could have come to the, commercially speaking, mm -hmm. yeah, uh, to the French side. Apparently, that's a state measure that we're trying to sort out again up to today. Yeah. Uh, but it's a state decision um, as far as we're concerned. So, it's not from the prefect then? From the prefect. Uh, the uh -huh. prefect is. is 
is a representative yes. of, um, of state. So when she takes a decision, she implicates um, state. Huh? She's there for that. And you have the prefect of region mm -hmm. who's above, but the prefect delegate has competencies to be able to handle the regular affairs on, on this island. So I, I think that's why people are so worried, though, because we, we are praying that it doesn't come to a lockdown. Mm -hmm. uh, France and the French have more resources than we have right now yeah. in terms of our relationship with yes. the Dutch government. So that is a big, big concern for the, the survival of this island. That she will say, "Well, and I'm not from here. I'm the prefet. You know, this is what it, the state is saying, and I'm going to do it." And that could be a problem. But that's why we try to keep a close relation between Prime Minister and myself and the, the, the executive um, um, of the Dutch side because we need to coordinate our policies and coordinate our actions. And I think that is very important for us to know exactly where we want to lead this country to and what are the measures to be able to take. We have been elected by the population, so we are due to take a certain mm -hmm. amount of responsibilities. And uh, we have to measure those responsibilities also in the decision making. But uh, I think we have not much issues in yeah. terms of our economy is strictly based on tourism. But I think that today, solidarity needs to remain. And that's the reason why um, I try to emphasize on the United Congress. And the reason I'm saying that, Aurel, is that we need to take decision um, in terms of cooperation that are common decision to the two local governments yeah. so that we don't change um, our, our, our vision of what we want for this territory. You know, a memorandum of understanding is a document that is signed between two persons, the prime minister and the president of the French side. And it holds only those two individuals. When you take a deliberation through a united Congress, you're talking about an executive of one side and an executive of the other side. And when you seal that deliberation by voting on it, yeah. in order to come back on that deliberation, you need to come back to, part, to the United Congress, rediscuss the matter, mm -hmm. and not just the fact of saying, you know, we changed government, so now this MOU doesn't work anymore. A deliberation will be standing for the policies to come. And if we want to change it, we have to go back in Parliament, which is the United Congress. So it gives more stability, more security to decision taking. So we can see and vision our policies, our strategy that we want coming on a longer base. So all those experiences of the past, whether they were good or whether they were bad, um, will, they were be, bad, discussed, they will were be discussed. Will be discussed. Will be discussed in uh, in the United Congress, and we will have a policy and a strategy for our way of communicating and our way of, I, I would say, uh, fetching the clients abroad, mm -hmm. um, the road network, the electricity, the water situation, um, the sewage um, situation also, all those um, decisions will be a common making decision in terms of a United Congress.